Hi there, this is Nellie Deutsch. Many of you uh, are having problems turning your cahoots into public cahoots. I'm going to start a new account to show you how it's done. You may need to start a new account, so beware of that. You may also have to change your age if you're under 13. I shouldn't be telling you this, but you can get your parents to create the account for you and then there's no problem at all so i suggest you do that so first thing i'm going to do is uh, sign up because i want a new account so notice my options teacher student personal professional now i'm not going to choose teacher or student i'm going to go in for personal because right now that's what you are you're just a personal and you want to create your own cahoots right so you're not really a student even though as a student you can also become a teacher as a teacher can become a student but let's do it for personal all right and see where that takes us you need to add the date of your birth and as i said you will need to get your parents to get an account for you if you are under the age of 13 or if you have some limitations due to age so please ask your parents and they'll be happy to do it for you since Kahoot is about learning, and I'm sure your parents would want you to continue learning. So I've added my age, and I'm going to add a username. Okay, now make sure you remember your username. So my user is going to be Nelly, and I'm sure there are other Nellies. So I'll probably need to make it, I'll make Nelly 28, since I was born on the 28th. Let's see if that works. Okay, continue, because I'm sure there are lots of 88s. Uh, lots of Nellies, so uh, let's make it 28, 8. Maybe that'll work, all right, since I was born on the 28th of the 8th. All right, so this works really nicely. Now I'm going to add an email. So I'm going to sign up with this Microsoft mail. Hopefully I don't have an account there. And go on to yes. Now notice for the personal use, I'm going to take the free, but you have to be aware that you can only host up to 10 players. And let's see what the differences are, because this may make an impact on your decision. I'm going to go to my account. So I chose basic and let's create a Kahoot. So uh, this is where I create a Kahoot. So let's do that now. Before I create a Kahoot, and notice I have the free version, I can share it right here. So you should be aware of that. You can also share the Kahoot. And if you open that up, look at the options. You can share the Kahoot, assign challenge, or up, well, upgrade. We don't want to upgrade, right? So let's create a Kahoot. All right, and this is how we create it. You can also have templates. All right, so why don't we just go for the template and then we're ready to go. All right, so we can, to the template, of course, we can add questions, okay, or not. Okay, but let's say we are done. Okay, so are we gonna take this? I think we are, it looks pretty good. Okay, next uh, we're going to go into Family Fun Quiz because let's say I want to use this one. Click on it and now it's mine. Okay, there's the title, um, the description if I want to keep it or, okay, you can save it to my cahoots or somewhere else. Branding off because we don't have the right. You can also paste the YouTube. Well, that's for upgrade. Okay, now notice here, everyone, you click on it. Well, let's do that. It's not only you, it's everyone. All right. And once you do that, you're done. And another, well, you can preview it if you want. And that's it. Okay. So uh, there it is in your My Cahoots. And you can play it. So you can use somebody else's or you can create your own. In addition, you can host this Kahoot by clicking on host. Let's click on it. This is all for free. And notice there are other things here that you can also choose, but you can play this one. Okay, host a Kahoot, family fun. That's the one you created. And notice here you can go to host. You've got two ways, the host and the challenge. You click on host. And that's it. 
Okay, you're ready to start. You just need to, of course, share it with everyone else. So I hope this has been of help. And there shouldn't be a question about making things public because it's easy enough. Thank you, but keep asking and subscribe. Have fun.